Thank you for watching, liking, commenting, sharing, and subscribing right now. 888 Perillo. This phone call sponsored by GoDaddy.com. This phone call sponsored by GoDaddy.com. This phone call sponsored. This is Chris. Hello. Hello. Hi, this is Josh. Hi, Josh. What are your thoughts on Windows 7? Um, in my opinion, Windows 7 is a great operating system. I have it running on my MacBook Pro. Okay. Now, why do you call it a great operating system? Um, because it beats the crap out of Vista. Um, <laughs> I'm running Vista on my iBuy Power machine. Um, it's definitely, um, it just, I don't like Vista. It freezes up a lot, you know. Now, have you then run Vista on that the MacBook Pro? That's what you said you have 7 running on. Had you run it on there before and had issues with Vista specifically on that hardware? Um, no, um, but, you know, I installed Windows 7, and it seemed like it froze up a lot less. And um, I actually sent you the email about the Corel audio driver problem. Oh, yes. Yeah, because there's, um, it, first of all, there was an issue um, involving the MacBook Pro when I installed Windows 7, there was like a red LED on the, um, like the, you know, the Mac, there was a, on the uh, headphone jack. And Interesting. It, it was a simple fix, it was just a download. Hmm. Well, I know that, uh, are you running it in boot camp? Correct. Apple doesn't seem to be supporting it yet, but, you know, it kind of goes without saying that they will. I've put 7 on boot camp, it was an RC, uh, it didn't seem to have too many issues. This, of course, is the uh, RTM from MSDN, um, but uh, I'm running it inside of VMware Fusion. It seems fine. In fact, I'd say the performance of Windows 7 inside of VMware Fusion is pretty much on par with that of Windows XP. Windows Vista inside a virtual machine was horrible, absolutely horrible. Yeah, I, I see what you mean. I, I tried to install it under VirtualBox. It was horrible. Yeah, it, it it's... Well, you know, I, I said it in the beginning when they released Vista. I said, this is not good. I was really upset when uh, Balmer came out and said that the, the community didn't give him enough feedback. I think that's a bold-faced lie. Either that or he wasn't paying attention. In fact, I've got an autographed copy of a Windows Vista Beta 2 disc. Uh, it's autographed by Jim Alchin, and he wrote, I'm sorry, on it. <laughs> because I was lambasting I him. It was, uh, you know, it, it was just not ready for prime time. I was, you know, years later, it, you know, everyone says, oh, yeah, Vista's horrible. I'm like, why weren't you saying that when Vista was released? You were getting mad at me because I was saying it was bad. Well, just because there's something better doesn't make it any worse than it, than it was. Seven's a good upgrade, though. Absolutely is, is a solid upgrade. Uh, I know I've got coupons for VMware Fusion. I'll have coupons for Windows 7. Did, have you picked up the, my Windows 7 ebook yet? Um, no, but I am planning on purchasing that, actually, within 24 hours, actually. Yay! It's only $7. It's not bad. 70 tips for Windows 7, and hey, if, if, if you don't learn anything, then you can pass it along to someone who may not know anything about Windows 7. Yeah, I see what you mean. I, I mean, I also actually had the uh, Corel audio issue with Windows XP as well. I mean, it seemed like every single Windows software I tried to install had that issue, hmm. which was kind of weird. It, on which machine? Was it a PC? Uh, no, it was actually my MacBook Pro. I have the 13-inch, uh, you know, the um, $1,500 model. Right. The newer one. And it seems to be like a common problem. I, like, I, I think I sent you an article about that. Yep, I remember getting it. So, yeah, I mean, but once I got it past that fix, it was just, it's such a worthwhile uh, upgrade. But, I mean, $120 is a lot versus $30 I paid for Snow Leopard. Oh, yeah, so. I mean... For sure. I'm going to be ordering a uh, new MacBook Pro 17-inch. It's going to be sponsored by PC Pit Stop, and uh, I'll be putting Windows 7 on that in boot camp uh, and dual booting between that and, of course, then Mac OS X and Snow Leopard here in the, in the near future. Yeah, that sounds great. I mean, I'm going to be um, – my uncle actually has an MSDN subscription, so I'll be lucky enough to get that yeah. um, update for free. So Without a doubt. Bad. I mean, I definitely like the system. Windows 7 was just a major breakthrough versus um, Windows Vista. Well, it, basically, I mean, 7 is what Vista should have been. Had Microsoft not tried to build the next iteration of Windows on managed code, which itself was beta, uh, it, it probably would have been... Uh, Vista would have been more like uh, Windows 7. But Vista is like a Millennium Edition, in my, in my opinion. A very... Uh, it, it's not good. Not... not uh, uh, not very pretty, shall we say.
Yeah, Millennium Edition was horrible. Yeah, but, no doubt. You know, I mean, I agree. I, I just, I don't like Vista. I mean, the feel, I mean, that's why I kind of like, that's why I switched to MacBook, to be honest. Well, you know, I, I'm a big I like fan it. of, no I, I'll say, you know, I'm a fan of Mac OS ten as well as Windows 7, but... You know, dollar for dollar, uh, you know, I, I'm really happy with Mac OS X as a, as a primary operating system. Uh, of course, I still like playing with Windows software, too. Looking forward to the VMware Fusion upgrade uh, so that I can have the full arrow uh, effects even inside of Mac oh, OS X. that now? Yeah, well, the new version, which is not out yet. They've got a release candidate of VMware Fusion. Uh, but like I said, I'm, I'm going to try to negotiate some coupons for the new version, so... Um, hopefully, you can save you money on that one too. Enough money to cover that Windows 7 ebook. Which, do you know where you can get that Windows 7 ebook? Um, I believe it's live.tagjag.com slash 7. Close. Go. Go. Go.tagjag.com. Oh, go. Right. Yeah, um... It's okay. It's, it's live.perlo.com. Go.tagjag.com. I've got all these URLs. Hey, have you tried. The, the new domains.tagjag.com, it wasn't working when I first posted the video to YouTube. Um, no, not yet, but I'll definitely be looking into yeah. that, and I'll purchase your um, ebook as well. Yeah, no worries. Even if you don't, like I said, you know, I just, I gotta, if you're gonna start with seven, I'm just trying to start the community out right, so. Yeah, and I appreciate that. Thank you very much for the um, advice. No worries, dude. Good luck. Have a nice day. All right, take care. All right, thanks. Bye. Bye.